Hello, food lovers. Today we're going on an adventure from the field to your feast. Have you ever wondered how the food on your plate makes its way from the farm to your table? Well, today, we're going to uncover that journey step by step. We'll discover how farmers grow rice, those tiny seeds that transform into fluffy grains. Rice farming is an intricate process that requires patience, skill, and a deep understanding of nature. Farmers begin by preparing the paddy fields, ensuring they are flooded with water. This creates the perfect environment for rice seeds to germinate and grow. We'll also explore the world of vegetables, bursting with colors and flavors. Vegetables are not just a side dish, they are a vital part of our diet, providing essential nutrients and vitamins. From the vibrant reds of tomatoes to the deep greens of spinach, each vegetable has its own unique journey from seed to harvest. Farming is vital because it puts food on our tables and knowing where our food comes from helps us appreciate it even more. When we understand the hard work and dedication that goes into growing our food, we can truly value every bite we take. Farmers markets are a great place to see this connection firsthand, where you can meet the farmers and learn about their practices. Farmers are like artists, using the earth as their canvas. Each field is a blank slate, and with every seed they plant they are creating a masterpiece. The process of plowing, planting and nurturing crops is a labor of love, requiring both physical effort and a deep connection to the land. They carefully plant each seed, nurture it with water and sunshine, and patiently wait for nature to work its magic. The growth of a plant is a miraculous process, one that transforms a tiny seed into a bountiful harvest. This transformation is a testament to the power of nature and the skill of the farmer. From the moment a tiny seed is sown to the time it reaches our plates, the journey of food is a fascinating one. Harvesting is a critical stage where the fruits of the farmer's labor are finally realized. The produce is then carefully packed and transported, ensuring it reaches us in the freshest condition possible. So, put on your imaginary wellies, and let's get started. Imagine the joy of visiting a farm, seeing the crops up close, and understanding the effort that goes into every meal. It's an experience that connects us to our food in a profound way, making us more mindful eaters and appreciative of the natural world. Before planting, the land needs preparation. This is the first and most crucial step in the journey of growing crops. The farmer, with his years of experience and knowledge, knows exactly how to turn a barren piece of land into a fertile bed, ready to nurture seeds. It's like getting a canvas ready for a beautiful painting. Just as an artist carefully prepares their canvas, a farmer meticulously prepares the soil. They spread fertilizers to enrich the land, ensuring that the seeds will have all the nutrients they need to grow strong and healthy. Farmers plow the soil, making it loose and airy for the seeds to grow. This process is essential as it allows air and water to penetrate deep into the soil, creating the perfect environment for seeds to germinate and roots to spread. They remove weeds and stones, ensuring the baby plants have the best possible start. Weeds compete with crops for nutrients, water, and sunlight, so removing them is vital. Stones can obstruct root growth so they are carefully picked out to provide a smooth path for the roots. Sometimes farmers use clever techniques like crop rotation. This ancient practice involves changing the type of crop grown in a particular field each season, which helps in maintaining soil fertility and reducing pest and disease problems. This means planting different crops in the same field each season. For example, a farmer might plant corn one year and beans the next. This not only helps in replenishing the soil, but also breaks the cycle of pests and diseases that can build up when the same crop is grown repeatedly. It helps keep the soil healthy and full of nutrients. Healthy soil is the cornerstone of successful farming. By rotating crops, farmers ensure that the soil remains rich in essential nutrients, which are crucial for the growth of healthy plants. Preparing the land is hard work, but it's the foundation for a bountiful harvest. The sweat and effort put into this stage are what make the difference between a mediocre yield and a bumper crop. Every step, from plowing to fertilizing, is a labor of love and dedication, ensuring that the seeds have the best possible start in life. Now comes the exciting part, planting the rice seeds. Farmers sow seeds in nurseries, special beds where the seedlings can grow strong before being transplanted to the main field. Imagine a nursery full of tiny rice plants all lined up in neat rows. These little seedlings are the promise of a future harvest. They represent hope and the circle of life continuing in the fields. Once the seedlings are big enough, they are carefully moved to the paddy fields. 
Rice loves water. Paddy fields are flooded with water, creating a unique ecosystem. The water helps regulate the temperature, keeping the roots cool and preventing weeds from growing. It's fascinating to see the reflection of the sky in the water-filled fields. The water level is carefully controlled throughout the growing season. Too much or too little can harm the plants. Farmers use channels and sluice gates to manage the water flow, ensuring the rice has the perfect amount to thrive. Nurturing growth, the patience of a farmer. As the rice plants grow taller, farmers keep a watchful eye on them. They walk through the fields daily, observing the subtle changes in the plants. Each day brings new challenges and new hopes. The farmers know that their vigilance is key to a successful harvest. They protect the crop from pests and diseases, ensuring healthy growth. This involves not just spraying pesticides but also using natural methods to keep the plants safe. They might introduce beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests, or use organic sprays that are less harmful to the environment. It's like taking care of a garden, but on a much larger scale. Imagine tending to thousands of plants, each one needing attention and care. The scale of the operation is immense, but the principles remain the same. Each plant is a part of a larger ecosystem that the farmer must manage. Sometimes, natural fertilizers like compost or manure are added to the soil. These organic materials enrich the soil, providing essential nutrients that the plants need to thrive. The farmers understand the importance of maintaining soil health as it directly impacts the quality and quantity of the harvest. This gives the plants extra nutrients to grow strong and produce lots of grains. Healthy soil leads to healthy plants which in turn leads to a bountiful harvest. The farmers' knowledge of soil science is crucial in this process as they balance the need for nutrients with the need to protect the environment. The farmers' patience and dedication are truly remarkable. They start their day early, often before sunrise, and work long hours under the hot sun. Their commitment to their crops is unwavering, driven by the hope of a successful harvest that will feed their families and communities. They nurture their crops with love, knowing that their hard work will eventually bear fruit. This love for the land and the plants is evident in every action they take. From planting the seeds to harvesting the grains, every step is done with care and attention. The farmers' connection to their fields is deep and profound, a testament to their enduring patience and dedication. Nature's Bounty, a rainbow of vegetables. While the rice grows, let's not forget about vegetables. They add color, flavor, and nutrition to our plates. Imagine a rainbow of vegetables, vibrant red tomatoes, leafy green spinach, bright orange carrots, and so much more. Each vegetable has its own unique growing season and requirements. Some, like tomatoes and cucumbers, love the sunshine and warmth. Others, like lettuce and spinach, prefer cooler temperatures. Harvesting vegetables is a joyful time. It's the culmination of months of hard work and dedication. Farmers carefully pick each vegetable at its peak ripeness, ensuring the best flavor and texture. Imagine the smell of fresh herbs and the sight of plump, juicy tomatoes ready to be enjoyed. The harvested vegetables are then carefully sorted, cleaned, and packed, ready to make their way to our kitchens. There's nothing quite like the taste of freshly harvested produce. The flavors are vibrant, the textures are crisp, and the aromas are simply divine. Imagine biting into a juicy strawberry still warm from the sun or savoring the sweetness of a freshly picked ear of corn. Freshly harvested food not only tastes better but it's also more nutritious. The vitamins and minerals are at their peak, giving our bodies the best possible fuel. Cooking with fresh produce doesn't have to be complicated. Some of the simplest dishes are the most delicious. Imagine tossing freshly picked vegetables with a little olive oil and herbs, then grilling or roasting them to perfection. A simple salad with a variety of colorful vegetables and a light vinaigrette is a refreshing and healthy choice. The key is to let the natural flavors of the fresh ingredients shine through. Every time we sit down to a meal it's important to remember the hard work and dedication of farmers all over the world. They brave the elements, nurture their crops, and provide us with the food we need to survive and thrive. So next time you see a farmer, give them a smile and a thank you. They are the unsung heroes of our food system and we are grateful for their contributions. From the tiny rice seeds to the bountiful harvest of vegetables, the journey of food from field to feast is a remarkable one. 
It's a story of hard work, dedication, and the deep connection between humans and nature. As we enjoy the fruits of their labor, let's appreciate the farmers who make it all possible. Let's savor every bite and remember that food is not just fuel, it's a celebration of life itself.